Hey guys, how's it going? Barrett back here and it's time for another penny box. And I know it looks a little different in this video. I'm actually out of town and I thought I'd stop by a bank while I was and pick up some stuff. So we got a circulated box of pennies. There's one that looks real interesting here. Check this one out. It's ugly. Oops, I didn't even put it in the camera. It's ugly, but I don't know. It looks really worn and ugly. So, but other than that, we're gonna have to search to see if there's anything. And then I got some halves. So I picked these up because I wanted to get a box of halves, but they didn't have one. But she had these and I figured, ah, what the heck. And these are kind of cool looking, check these out. I know they've probably been looked through. It looks like these have been peeled back, but they're kind of a cool old wrapping. This one's even got somebody signed it. And you can tell that's an old person's writing. Like I said, I'm pretty sure they've been looked through, but I figured what the heck, we'd give them a shot. So before we get started, please subscribe, like, and comment on the video and hit that bell, notify you when I put more up. And let's get started. Alrighty, let's get started on these halves. And like we said, guys, we all know how customer wrap rolls are. We don't really expect anything. And not really anything looking too great there. No silver, obviously, but... That will thumb through them and see. There is nothing in that one. All right, this next one, we'll save those cool looking wraps for last. I don't wanna ruin them, I think they're cool looking. <laughs> All right, and not seeing any silver there either. see how I'm gonna do this here. I don't have my little screwdriver so we'll see if we can just peel it up. Which I don't know if that's working or not. Ah, I don't want to tear them apart. Man, as hard as they're come, having to come apart, maybe they could be good. Who knows? All right. We got that side open. Let's see if we can push them through here. Ugh. Oh, there's one. All right. We're through. Wow. Look at that. They all look new. What are they all going to be? Bicentennial? They are. It's a roll of bicentennials. Well, they're all in pretty good shape. We'll have to set those aside and that's kind of cool. Well, maybe, maybe that gives us hope for the next ones, right? Hope so. Alrighty, let's get on with roll number two. And you know, that gives us a little, uh, a little hope that maybe something might be in these other two with a whole row of nice bicentennials. Yeah, you never know. This is the one that they signed. So, hopefully they didn't, uh, well, you know, maybe it's a roll, no, 70, we got 71s, 72s and 73s. Don't see anything standing out as silver. 71, seven, yes. What do we got? Looks like they're all 71s, 72s, and 73s. So maybe they took a whole collection in and somebody already snagged up the 
the older ones. These are all 71s, 72s, and 73s. All right, what's on the end of this one? That's a 72. We can't tell there. All right, well, let's check out the third and final one. I don't know how the heck they, they got those back together so good, but this one's taped. So I have a feeling. Yeah, I don't know. I have a feeling it's going to be the same as the last one. I think it's going to be all 72s, 73s. That's my guess. I can even get into it. There, I think I've got the tape off. All right. Dang, that would have been too cool to find somebody's dump of, why couldn't they have been 64s or Benjis or Walkers? All right, what do we got? They all look pretty new to me. There we go, what are we gonna be? 73. 73, what is this gonna be, a roll of 73s? That's what it is. It is a roll of 73s. Alrighty, well. Oh, pretty nice 73s. All right, there we go. That is the half, so now we're going to go on to the pennies, guys. Stay tuned. All righty, guys, we're on roll number seven. We're not going to have our first weedy, but we do have a cool hit. We got a young head. There we go. What year do we got? 1963. All right, that's pretty cool. If you don't get a weedy, at least a young head or a King George is pretty cool. And let's see anything else in here. And all right, that's gonna do it. Well, let's move along. All righty, guys, roll number ten. We're gonna have our first weedy, close to an ender, fourth one in, and it was weedy side up. So we get to reveal it together. What do we got? Hey, check that out. That's pretty cool. First one is a pre-40 Weedy. We got a, looks like a 1939S. All right, that's awesome. Pre-40s are always cool. And when you only get one to start, that's even better. Let's see if we got anything else in here. And that's going to do it. All right, let's move it on. All righty, guys, we're on roll 15, and we're going to have at least a couple. We got one pointing up at us right here, and then back here, I don't know if you can see it from the video there, we got a wheat right there. So we got at least two here. So our first one is a 1941 Philadelphia. There we go. All right. Pretty cool. All right. And the second one back here. Looks like it could be. Could be older. Well, let's take a look. No. We got a 48 San Francisco. Let me just double check. Yep. 48 San Francisco. Let's see if we got anything else. 68. And two in that roll. That'll do it. All right. Three in that. We're up to three. All right. That'll work. All right. Let's move along. All righty, guys. Next roll. And we got our fourth weedy. I thought it was older when I first saw it. And there we go. It is a 1940 Denver. There we go. Number four. All right. That was towards the middle. And that's going to do it for that roll. And let's bring you back on the next one. 
All righty, it's three rolls in a row. We've got number five of the box. This one's seen better days. It's at least, I know it's a 46. I can't, there's some damage there. I don't know if it's got a mint mark or not, but it's, uh, yeah, it's a little beat up. But there we go. That is number five. Three rolls in a row, that's pretty cool. Hopefully, uh, Hopefully we can hit number four in a row here in just a second. All right, let's get to it. All right, roll number 20. Unfortunately, we didn't get four in a row, but we're back at it. This will be weedy number six. There we go. And it is a 56 Philadelphia. All right. Number six, not too bad through 20 rolls. Let's hope that keeps going and we'll be good. All right, we'll bring you back. All righty, guys, we went on a dead streak. We got that sixth one and it went poof. But we are on roll 36 and we're going to have number seven. Oh, I didn't even know that was one. We're going to have number seven and number eight because I had this one right here which is kind of beat up, but there it is. That's number seven. And that's going to be a 51S. There we go. And then this one that I just flipped over that I didn't even see. Look at that sucker. That is worn. And then the front... I can't even read it. I'm going to have to clean it up a little and see what we got but we did get number seven and number eight so oh, there's a 2009 yeah that was pretty good for going blank for so many rolls to get two in there that was pretty cool all right let's move on Alrighty guys, roll 39, and I'm not 100% sure, but this one looks old. Oh, it is. It isn't as old as I thought it could be, but it is a 1941 Philadelphia. So that will be our ninth weedy. And see if there's anything else in here. I mean, there is not. A couple rolls will go. I forgot when I got those two right before that one. Right at the end of the roll, I got this. Another young head, and it is a 1959. Pretty cool. Alrighty, so we're getting down to it. Let's go. Alrighty, guys, roll 47 is going to give us our 10th weedy. It was face up right there. There it is right there. And it is a 48D. All right. And that will do it there. I looked a little closer at that one that was dirty. I thought it was going to be older. But it was, it looked like a 46, 46S. I know. Even with the back, you know, looking how sleek it is. But no, 46S. So, all right, we got three rolls left. Let's get to them. All righty, guys, let's go ahead and wrap this up. Not a bad box. We got some cool finds. So we ended up with 10 Wheaties. We got that 39S, 40D, 41P, two of those. And I think that's a 46S, and that looks like a 46, not sure if there's a mint mark, uh, 48D, and a 48S, 51S, and a 56P. That's kind of weird, only two in the 50s. So, and we got two young heads, a 63 and a 59. We got seven total Canadians and seven total 2009s. So not a bad hunt there, guys. Uh, yeah, so that was pretty cool. So only thing I'll tell you guys is till the next one.